All right, this is 1050 North Gardner, Unit 1. So this is right off of Gardner. Gardner is right there. That is uh, Santa Monica Boulevard. You don't hear it by any means once you're inside, but it's worth noting. Uh, this is a two bedroom, two bath, a little over 1,300 square feet. There is security cameras outside the building and gated around. Um, but you are not actually inside the gate because you're the front unit. Uh, that's just worth noting. Um, HOAs are $500 a month. That just includes two parking spaces, obviously security and landscape. And let's head in. So you come in, all the windows are frosted so you don't see out, uh, which is a nice little feature. Um, ceilings are probably 10 to 12 feet which are really nice they're really high it's really cool. when you come over here you have a nice little private patio um, edges all around which is nice that's the laundry yeah oh this one too and that's a closet yeah good just for storage yeah yeah that's central air central heat obviously we got some extra storage space right to the left here. Really deep storage. I mean, really deep. You could, this is probably four feet in, which is really nice. Stainless steel appliances, nice modern feel. Dishwasher, fridge, big fridge. Uh, and then you have this nice island with two seats. Here. They kind of have the table set up over here with the fixture up top. I would assume this is where the table would always go. Uh, a little over, like I said, 1,300 square feet. This is pretty much the main space. Um, a lot of room. We come back here and to the left through these double doors is the washer dryer. Nice big size washer dryer. I like that it's not in a bedroom, so you don't have to deal with hearing it uh, when it's on. And then the hallway is really spacious right here. It's not one of those tight hallways. It's really wide open and it opens up into the kitchen, which is good. And then more storage space. Um, so there's multiple closets around, which is great. Um, this is the main bathroom very wide uh, you know the this is not a small bathroom it's really well done actually uh, the building was built in 2005 so appliances and fixtures and you know renovations you could tell are recently done um, and it all looks good the tile running up to the top to prevent any mold or asbestos this is a really nice size uh, bathtub. And then you come back here. Are you guys the, uh, and then this is the second bedroom. They're both very spacious bedrooms. Um, I would say they're both the same size. But actually this one's probably smaller. This uh, engineered wood is ran out, ran through the entire house, this dark engineered wood. Um, it's actually pretty well done or well kept at least. There's no scratch marks or anything. Uh, big, nice walk-in closet right here. I always say write it up though, like Excuse what always me, write guys. it up in yeah, the yeah. upper room. Right and then here place. is the main, you got a nice big closet to the right, walk-in closet. Oh, it's, so um, it's got one of these nice pocket doors, so you can close off the closet completely. Um, ceilings are just as high out here, 10, 12 foot ceilings, which is a nice feature. It makes it feel a lot more uh, comfortable. It doesn't feel like an apartment. It feels more like a loft or condo, condominium. Uh, so, 
Again, here is the bedroom. It is probably now that I'm looking at both of them, probably about the same size as the other bedroom. But this bath, this bedroom has a bathroom in it. So here's the main. Uh, nice closet. So now you have the walk-in, and then you also have this closet as well. So, and then you come back here. Nice modern bathrooms. The bathrooms match the kitchen really well, which is really nice. Uh, you got his and hers sinks, and then the tile is actually the same as in the other bathroom. So, uh, really clean, white, modern. Uh, nice bathroom. So even if you look at like all the baseboards, it's really well kept this house. Everything is very clean, nice. There is a tile that runs in this bathroom, which is different than the hardwood. And then you have this really nice chandelier fixture right in your main, which is great. This property just came on the market. Alright, so this is the second bathroom. Oh, excuse me, second bedroom. It's one final walkthrough. The only good 10 feet. So you get even in the bedroom, so you get that. And then I'll go here private patio so once you're inside the unit it's actually private uh, so you go through your front door right which is right here and then you get back here and you have this really nice private backyard yes you could see you know back here but it's great to be on the first floor you don't have to deal with the elevator or anything um, it's just really private and you are a couple streets from Santa Monica but right now if nobody speaks it's very quiet so it's really peaceful back here. All right, that's about it for this one. Go back in the kitchen one more time just so you have it. All that's already done for you, you know? Nice deep sink, nice big sink. Like for food. Well, not here, here. Yeah, I would probably dress this up. Could probably make this pantry or somewhere on the other side as well. All right. Oh, a lot of storage down here below. A lot of storage down here. All right, that's it. On to the next house.